when ZL is equal to zero, when we have a short circuit, the voltage reflection coefficient is infinity and the total voltage is zero at the load. It's a minimum. We see this in the plot. As we move away from this minimum, the voltage magnitude increases to a maximum. In other words, the voltage waveform is simply a shifted version in space by a quarter wavelength compared to the case of the open circuit load shown earlier. And again, we can see this better in a video. Here. The primary difference here is that the total voltage is zero at the load rather than at some distance from the load. And again, we get a standing wave set up, which is a combination of the two traveling waves. Wave traveling to the load and one reflected from the load. All right, finally, how do you think the voltage magnitude varies along a matched transmission line? It varies sinusoidally in time because we have a sinusoidal source, but what is the maximum voltage anywhere along the transmission line that we attain?